Hi, I'm Jess. I'm Carrie. Where that's random. Intention was to have a random pop quiz right yeah, now. Yeah, we're going to have a pop quiz. And then we did art with rubber cement. Yeah, you saw it the other day. This is a very small room. It and this is, is old and potent. And I can't concentrate right now. Nope. So Jess anyway. couldn't come up with any questions to ask. So I am going to ask Jessica a pop quiz. <laughs> Apparently it's an interview now. It's so going to be an interview. I, I'll answer. I don't know what we're about to probably. share, but I'm here I wrote for down it. three things. Um, she wants to talk about. Yeah. I don't really care if we talk about them or not. Well, but it's happening and we're here together. Here we friend. go. All right. So Jessica, do you have any superstitions or weird routines that you're afraid to break or that, you know, whatever? No. <laughs> okay. That was fun. <laughs> Sorry. So I, I sort of do like, um, I am wearing a chief shirt and I'm afraid they're going to lose because I haven't worn a chief shirt or chiefs anything on game day. You better take that off season. before they start. But if I, I'm not going to work at Dylan's after this. And if you wear your NFL team or college team logos, then you don't have to wear your apron. You just put your name tag on. And I thought, okay, I'll wear chiefs and I won't have to wear my apron. Let's switch teams. Who do we not care about? And yeah. Wear that. Well, they're playing the bills. If I had bills, I could wear that. So what might. what if we just take a regular shirt and some like painter's tape or masking tape and we'll write mm -hmm. a different team? Bill. I should Bill? Wear, a Bill. wear a Bill name tag. And I can wear, wear <laughs> Bill's shirt. We, yeah. we should, should just should create like that in our next them. art. <laughs> right. Name tags for carrying. But I also have like a cute yard flag of the Chiefs that I got after they won the Super Bowl. I haven't put it out all season and I thought, ooh, I should put it out today. I couldn't because I'm afraid that I will jinx them. Okay, so fans, this video is going up a few days after the game happens. And uh, if we're sad right now, you you can see why. It's Carrie's fault. She's admitting it. And if they win, I guess the superstition didn't matter and it I wasn't don't, her fault. I won't have, to, I won't have to take on so much responsibility. So a lot of people counting on her to not ruin <laughs> no, it right now. So I might change. Best wishes. <laughs> if I change, if we win, I'll have to let you know if it's because I changed or not. <laughs> Okay. Next right. question. Both of us had some snow days. Yeah. I had more and she's really She salty keeps sending me the text messages, like the updates. Like, Just I, shut thought, up. gonna go I thought everything. that we were having fun and no, we're, we're not. I, I was and I wasn't even trying to be catty about it. I was just like, can you believe this? She's over it. We live so, in the same town, friends. That's why. <laughs> like, we we live, should have we the, same the same snow days. We work we in not. completely different yeah. areas of the state. Yeah. So, anyway, but we both have had some snow days mm -hmm. more than normal. Oh, yeah. Me, way more. Yeah. <laughs> and so, what's something you did on a snow day? I was very lazy on the snow days. I stay in jammies and I watch the like, random shows for background sound. And I play on my phone extra. Yeah, I did some of that. But since I had so many, I started feeling guilty. And I started making myself do do some things. Because it seemed like they they were bonus days at home. That I should be a little productive at some point. Yeah, I took it as my sign that it was okay to sleep and have meals. Right. And I did that instead. And I think you're accurate. Stock up I think for that's winter. Right. <laughs> I think that's right. Like a little chipmunk. <laughs> I think for you, you needed to do that. But I had so many yeah. ridiculous extras. Days when we thought it was going to be a late start that turned into a whole day and stuff like that. Yeah, but, so you wake up early. Yep, so I sorted through some bags of, like, paperwork, like, like all the mail that stacks up that oh, you yeah. hide real quick when you need to clean and you didn't want to. Yeah. That I went through some of that stuff. Good job. Yeah. All right. Last one. So give us an update on any of your New Year's resolutions or the ones that I made for you. <laughs> what I did you make? You told you've me gotten that a we little were... more to eat and a little more sleep thanks to yes, snow. snow days help me. Thanks I think to nature. Yeah. On the days I didn't have school, I did all the things you asked me to do. I was really good on those days. So proud of you. Yeah. I know you've had green in yours because I've given you all sorts of fun things. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I did have to do some green mm -hmm. as a part of some challenges. Yeah. Um, for my specific making them myself, I've done a little bit. Like, I did, I've been wearing pajamas. <laughs> That was like, that was not one of your resolutions. It was one for myself. You didn't announce that. 
Oh, you I announced did. your projects that you're gonna do. I did those. What were you doing before? I just like sleep in like some sweats, random sweats or shorts or something. But now, because I get pajamas every year at Christmas, every year from my mom or we get matching ones and I have this huge drawer of great pajamas. And um, at Christmas time we play games and when games make me laugh, then I have to change my pajamas. <laughs> You know. We know. <laughs> and so I thought I should wear these pajamas more often than just Christmas. And so I have been. So That's there's great. that. And I've been trying to read more. So I've got a couple books going. A bathroom book. I thought, well, if I didn't take my phone into the bathroom, I could read this book. And it's kind of a graphic novel, which I've never really been into, but I've been enjoying it. And another book that I read before bed. And then my other one is, I read somebody... Somewhere a TikTok video or something, somebody was like, um, it was about organization and motivation kind of thing. And they were like, if it takes less than a, mi than a minute, do it now. Oh, yeah. So I've been telling That's myself smart. that. And I've been doing that more often. Like, instead of throwing my coat on the chair, I'm like, okay, it takes less than a minute to hang this up. Mm -hmm. Go do it. Go hang it up. It takes less than a minute to open your closet and put your shoes where they belong. Do it. So I don't do it 100%, but it's better. If it takes less than a minute, do it now. That's good advice. Yeah. There you go. I'm glad you read so we could learn something. Yeah, I, I don't. I didn't read that, I promise. I did not read that. Okay. We Tick, learned anyway. TikTok. Reels, there you go. something. There you go. Pop quiz with Carrie. <laughs> and Jess is here. And Jess answered. <laughs> there you go.